I was jumping on the... Today's election day. It's the 7th of May. Mr. Ball, thank you very much for joining us. First of all, there's been this... I'll be honest, oh, I'm not asked, but I get in, as long as the uh, long as, uh, Conservatives don't get in. I've done that, I'm not going to be asked. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I haven't been able to vote because uh, I am 17, I missed out by a year. I missed out by a year. Not even that. But six more I missed out. It's going. But yeah. That's the new um, BBC News. To be honest, I don't have a clue what all these numbers mean. I don't got a fucking clue. Well, I, I think the exit poll is a very big surprise. Okay, seats. Uh, Labour's got three seats, I think. Peter, Don't know, but yeah. Well, oh, I guess we'll be back when we find out who's won. Well, this is some of this class bullshit. It's the 8th May now, day after voting day. Conservatives have 121 seats, need 126 to be in. Which bastards voted for the Conservatives? Oh, dickheads. Look at that. That's stupid. Why? They fucked up the country in the past five years and they're going to continue fucking up the country. I'll tell you now, these predictions are bullshit because they always predicted they only get 316 and they got only 321. Five seats to win. Five seats. If we get another five years of bullshit conservatives. Which is fucking great. Fourteen seats to be declared. Conservatives only need f five of them. Okay. I kind of need to revise for shit, so I'll be back when the final results are out. Probably saying conservatives won. Uh, I'm gonna enjoy that. We got another seat. We only need four now. <clears throat> so that means Nigel Farge is quit. Another five years for a Tory government. You yeah, need three now. Well, good news. I'm almost home. After being bullshitted and fucked around the buses again, as per usual. What time is it now? Oh, well, it's two minutes to six and I have to be somewhere for six o'clock. And I haven't been home yet. I've got to go at home, get change, and get some to eat. And then walk the in two minutes. Anyway. Election. Oh, joy, that was fucking fun. Ooh. 
and it's raining. Oh, fuck now. Um, oh, joy. Conservatives one. If you didn't already know, if you don't know, where the fuck have you been? Have you been hiding under a rock and not known? You don't know, I don't know how, I don't, I, 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 yeah, whatever. But yeah, Conservatives one. The last time I checked, they had 130 seats. Oh no, 130. 330 seats. And they needed 120, uh, 326 to win. So they've won by quite a margin. Um, we have got, last time I checked, 232. And there was a seat available, or left, last time I checked. Because Saint Ives hadn't posted their vote yet, or finished counting, or whatever the fuck they were doing. Bear in mind, this was at about one o'clock, so five hours since then. Um, fucking hell, it's cold. Ah, it's out fucking rain, it's freezing cold. What the fuck? Ah. But yeah, um, <sighs> Tory government for the next five years. Fun. I'll be honest, I don't know why I did this video, I just thought, hey, why the fuck not? It's uh, quite a reasonably large event in the UK. Uh, elections decide, decide who governs and leads our country. But yeah, uh, if you like the video, like it. If you didn't like it, because of politics, why did you start watching it? And, uh, don't forget to check out other videos if you haven't already seen them. And the water is on the camera. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna go now and uh, attempt to get some of my six o'clock. Yeah, it's too much past six, that's not gonna happen. <sighs> and I'm pissed wet for me. Right. Oh, great, um, I'm just gonna now.